Okay, this is a little video to show how to set up um, your Amiga to run Scum VM. Um, this is uh, an Amiga 1200. Um, the first thing to do is to make sure you've got the right version of AHI, which is what it uses to, to, do, this, to do the sound. Um, if you've got anything other than version 4.18, if you've got anything newer than that, it's going to run very slowly. So make sure you've got the right version. So your AHI um, device should be um, version 0.18, as I said earlier. That's correct. Um, and in audio modes, an AHI, AHI should just be Paula Audio. Shouldn't be any other stuff in there you're not using. And just Paula in audio modes. That should allow you to set up, um, to run the preferences program without any errors appearing. If you've got any errors, it means that something's wrong. Um, ScumVM uses unit zero here. Now what you want to do is you want to make sure you choose one of these fast modes. These are much um, faster, surprisingly, than the other ones. Um, um, 8 bits going to be faster than 14 bit. Um, the fastest one's actually going to be this one here, 8 bit stereo. I use 14 bit stereo calibrated because I've got a fast machine so I can do that. Um, the other thing to look at is the frequency. Um, you want to try and match the, the setting having scum VM so it doesn't have to do mixing. Um, so I've got it set to 22, that's that's quite high. If you've got a slow machine, you'd want to bring it right down to um, 8000, which is the minimum that's supported in, in scum VM. Okay, now we'll run scum VM itself. So this is version 1.5. This is the version I've just ported. I'll just take take you through here quickly. Um, one of the things you need to look at um, um, when you first install the program is you need to make sure your paths are set correctly. So your save path, uh, where it's going to put the save games. Um, theme path, you don't have to set because it just defaults to the root. Um, this is very important, this extras path. Um, so if it's on the route here, you should you should select that. These these are certain data files that are needed by certain games. So if you haven't got that set, they won't work. Uh, the other one to look at is here, um, auto save. You should make sure it's on never because it'll be it'll be faster. Um, if you're lucky enough to have a, an external MIDI device, you want to choose CAM here. Um, in audio, um, you choose your preferred device, um, and there's the output rate that I spoke about earlier. That's set to the same as my HI setting. Um, DOSBox here is better quality than main, so that's a good one to choose. If you haven't got external MIDI, then you, you want to choose um, Creative probably here, Creative Emulation. Um, there. Um, I've got Cam, so I have that. Um, and that's that's basically it. Um, and then obviously you, you add a game here by hitting this button. Just navigate to your game and choose it with this button here. And then when you've added your game, it'll appear in this list. Um, so what we might do is we might run a game quickly. Um, like for example, Discworld's a good one. You just double click to run a game. Wake 
just quit this. So there you go. That's how you set up um, ScumVM uh, to run on your Amiga. Enjoy. <laughs>